it's Brittany here with another book review. Um, um, today we're doing Daddy's Little Girl by Mary Higgins Clark. Mary Higgins Clark is this lady and she has a butt ton of books. <laughs> like, ridiculous, like, over, probably like over 30 books. I'm, like, she has as many books as Nora Roberts. <laughs> It's maybe more. I don't know. But, um, her books are like really mystery based. Like, you know, someone gets kidnapped or someone's murdered or, you know, stuff like that. This one is, it's, it's a first person book. And at first, I was, when I first, like, read the, like, prologue, I was like, this is not first person like what is, does she not know what first person is but then I quickly realized that she was doing it in little kids first person so it's not going to sound like a regular she's calling herself Ellie that would be as if I was like Brittany wants to do a book review for you today Brittany thinks this book is really awesome like <laughs> Like that. Apparently, Corley's trying to take a book from me. So, alright. So, basically, from this book it is about this girl named Ellie, and it starts off when she's little, and like she finds her sister murdered and everything, and like the dude that did it was convicted and everything, and then like years later, it like but fast forward to years later, and um, Ellie's like 25, she's 20 something, and um, her killer is like, the ki her sister's killer is about to get out, his name's Rob Westerfield, he's like this little, he's like a rich boy and stuff, about to get away with everything, um, he's about to like get out of jail, and she's going, trying to go to his probation hearing get out the way all right probationary <laughs> hearing to um vote against him getting probation like oh he's a sociopath like psycho don't let him out and everyone's like he served his time for killing your sister or whatever like get over it and like then other people are like, you never did it in the first place, you put him away for nothing. And they're trying to do like a, Ralph Westerfield and his family's trying to do like a recoil and postpone it on this other dude named Polly. And like, Ellie's like digging up more and more evidence showing that he did do this. And she has this website and like, is posting up like video, like, not videos, like, um, stories and stuff from when he was younger, like from other people, showing that he was basically, you know, a sociopath. Like, he gets off on, like, hurting other people and, like, his anger problems and stuff like that, and he's been charged with assault and stuff before, and it's all been covered up. So he's like, he really is a bad person. He really did do this. And everyone's like, Ellie, you're crazy. And, like, she has like threats on her life and stuff and it's just like it's really good and of course like in the end everything goes wonderfully and he gets thrown back in jail but <laughs> but like the end I'm not gonna give it away because it's it's my favorite part in the book when Rob Westerfield finally gets caught and thrown back in jail it's like my favorite part it's like so pumped it like made me so pumped I was like oh no don't do it because Rob is give it away. I don't want to give it away. But I basically give you a happy ending anyway. It's like, I don't want to get too detailed, but it's my favorite part. Okay, so look out for the part if you read this, like, where Rob Westerfield gets caught. I guarantee you, like, the 20 minutes before he gets caught, like, basically he's chasing Ellie. That's all I'm giving you. Okay, that part, mmm, wonderful piece of the literariness. Like, oh, I love it. It's amazing. I, like, wish I 
the lighter part. Um, the Simon and Schuster Publishing Agency in 2002. Um, I'm going to rate it a five out of five stars because, like, it's awesome. It's just a good book. Like, I don't know. Like, at first I didn't think I was gonna like it. You um, and like after the first couple of chapters, because it does build up, but it gets to she has a really good way of like building things up. Like after like a couple chapters, I was like, oh my god, oh my god, I can't put this down. I can't do it. I just can't put it. Like it's just one of those books. So I highly recommend. It. First five out of five review. Four book. Four book so far. Daddy's little girl. Okay. So I hope you read it. Thanks for watching. Bye.